Oklahoma at Iowa State. Iowa State, a one-point dog. Total is 56 over at BetUS, 12 p.m. Eastern time on FS1 on Saturday. And let's go ahead and pull up our numbers here, and I'll tell you the trends. Oklahoma is 2-5 and five against the spread in their last seven against Iowa State. Oklahoma 0 and 4 against the spread their last four overall, 1 3 and 1 against the spread on the road, and 2 and 6 against the spread on the road against losing teams. So teams with a losing record thus far. So trends certainly do not like Oklahoma all that much. But let's take a listen to Iowa State. 2 6 and 1 against the spread against the team with a winning record. That's not good. 1 3 and 1 against the spread in their last five home games. That's not good. But. They are 7-2-1 and one against the spread after a straight-up loss, which they just had. So, something to pay attention to with that. You look at these numbers, and I have got Oklahoma. Uh, my numbers have them by a little more than three points, and this is over the last five weeks. So, that includes when they lost Gabriel, etc. It's got all that stuff tied into it. If you take out the game against Texas, Oklahoma would be favored by significantly more here. They, their offense is significantly more explosive. I know that their defense is not good, but I like what Oklahoma is doing, especially on the ground. Uh, Iowa State number 59 in rushing success rate allowed on defense. Oklahoma is number 33. Um, PPA per rush, pretty even, 26 for Iowa State, number 31 for Oklahoma. Uh, but when you look at the passing attack, like I said, this bakes in all that time that Gabriel missed. They're number 90 in PPA per pass. Iowa State is number 103 in PPA per pass. They're number 115 in passing success rate allowed. I I think that Oklahoma can find ways to score much easier than Iowa State. You look at Iowa State, what they're doing, number 88 PPA per pass, they're number 112 in PPA per rush. They don't really do anything well. Standard downs PPA, they're not good there. Standard down success, they're, you know, number 109 for Iowa State there. I know Oklahoma's defense is bad, but you've got a, a not good offense here that can constantly find themselves behind the chains. I I like Oklahoma to be a little bit more consistent here. Give me the Sooners to cover the one on the road. I know a lot of people like Iowa State right now. You know They've lost a lot of games, et cetera, but Oklahoma looks like the team that has the more explosive capabilities, and I think they're more consistent. I will take them to cover here. Thanks for listening to Winning Cures Everything. Make sure and subscribe on YouTube or your favorite podcast app. And make sure to leave a nice five-star review. You can follow Gary on Twitter, at GaryWCE. And the show is at Winning Cures. Be sure to check out the merch in our web store and share the show.